What's up guys, in this video I'm gonna show you all the looping spots with the new difficulty patch in Phasmophobia. As you may know, the latest patch introduced ghost features that are supposed to make looping impossible. I'm gonna show you how and why you can still do it and why it's much more difficult now. If you stick around to the end, you will see if I was able to loop a crawling ghost around the sofa in Richview. Just keep in mind, this may get changed by the time you watch this video. If you haven't watched my patch video, I'm gonna link that in the top right corner. The change that was supposed to make looping impossible was that all the ghosts, except revenants, are speeding up when they are in line of sight of you. All ghosts, except revenants, are slightly slower than you, but they can speed up and become faster than you over time. If you break line of sight though, they go to the last location they've seen you. If they already increase the speed, they will maintain the speed until they reach that spot. If they can't see you anymore, they will slow down again. So the main key to looping now is to break line of sight. And the good news is, this new patch also introduced a feature where furniture breaks line of sight. It looks like that the ray costs that the ghosts use to get line of sight of you are spawning in the middle of the body of the ghost. And even crawling ghosts seem to have that ray cast at the same height. So this basically means if we find an object in the game world that is solid and high enough, we can loop around it by crouching. The ghosts will keep losing line of sight of us, so they aren't really able to speed up. This though also makes looping more dangerous now, because if they are losing line of sight of you, they could change directions. So while you're looping, you always need to be mindful where the ghost really is behind you. Because at any point, he could change directions and walk right into you. So if you want an extra challenge, try that with a crawling ghost, because you cannot really see the crawling ghost across the kitchen counter. I also want to quickly boss the myth now, because I heard it several times now, that strafing should be somehow slower than running forwards and backwards. Here is proof of it, they are exactly the same speed. So without further ado, let's have a look at the loop spots in the game. All the loop spots shown are meant to be looped in crouched position. First off is Tanglewood and here you can loop around the kitchen counter and the car in the garage. I would not loop around the dining table because it has holes like a Swiss cheese. Number 2 is the asylum and here you can loop around the reception in the entrance area. You can also loop around the conference table in the basement of the asylum. And you can also loop upstairs in the kitchen of the asylum around the kitchen counter. Number 3 is Bleasdale and here you can loop around the kitchen counter, the dining table and the sofa in the living room. Number 4 is Grafton and here you can do the same thing, you can loop around the kitchen counter, the dining table or the sofa in the living room. The safer spot to loop around though would be around the center, through the two doors, through the kitchen, the living room and the dining room. And you can also loop in the utility room upstairs. Number 5 is Prison. On Prison you can loop around the chairs in the entrance area. To some degree you can also loop in the big corridor with the large cell walls. The cell bars also block line of sight from time to time, but it will be much more dangerous. I would rather loop through these three doors in the entrance area. You can also loop upstairs in the two warden offices around the big tables. And you can also loop in the big office around the two tables with the computers on it. Number 6 is Richview and on Richview you can loop around the kitchen counter. Now let's have a look if you can loop the ghost around the sofa in Richview. As you can see, even though it was a crawling ghost, I successfully looped the ghost around the sofa. Edgefield has the same sofa as Richview, so you can do that there as well. 
let me know in the comments if you keep looping the ghosts with the new patch. Thank you guys for watching and we see us in the next one. Oh, all these patrons. Thank you so much guys for your support. Mwah. Big schmutz. Mm -hmm.